The stage is set for a political showdown in India's Maharashtra. Assembly elections will be held on November 20th and votes will be counted on November 23rd. The western state, home to India's financial capital of Mumbai, will witness an intense battle between two multi-party alliances. Campaigning for all political parties came to an end earlier in the evening today. Six major parties in the states are pitted against each other as part of two larger umbrella alliances defending their position of power in the Mahayuti alliance led by the Bharatiya Janata Party, the breakaway faction of Shiv Sena led by Eknath Shinde and NCP led by Ajit Pawar are also part of the bloc. And in the opposition, fighting for a return to power is the MVA alliance led by Congress. The Uddhav Thakre-led Shiv Sena and Ajit Pawar's NCP are a part of this alliance. 288 assembly seats are up for elections across 26 districts in Maharashtra. The state has over 90 million registered voters who will exercise their ballot in a single phase election. More than 100,000 polling stations are being set up ahead of the November 20th elections. Now, a lot has changed in Maharashtra's political landscape in the past two years. Following the split in Shiv Sena and NCP, this is where the numbers currently stand. Out of a total of 288 seats, BJP has 103, followed by Congress and Ajit Pawar's NCP at 43 each. Shinde's Shiv Sena has 40, the Thakre faction of Shiv Sena has 15, and Sharad Pawar's NCP has 10. For all the latest news, download the Vyond app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.